every 10 feet. Roughly 16,000 lane miles of uh, paint on the roads. And about 10 miles an hour. That we are moving slow. If you have a gunner that sits back here, they apply the paint. And you have a driver that's actually steering the truck to keep it online. Online with a laser and on turns, a mirror. Seven striping crews spread out between Augusta, Turner and Bangor, laying down the line. 1,500 gallons of paint a day, anywhere from 4,500 to 6,000 pounds of beads a day. Beads of glass embedded in the road, completely safe to drive over. We add that on top. You wouldn't want to get it in your eyes, but you can hold it in your hand, you can move it around, doesn't cut you. It's 80% round, and that's what allows the light to return back to you when your headlights are hitting it at night. Safer for you, and they ask you make it safer for them. And we ask the public for patience. We're always looking to make it as safe for them, but we don't want them to get into the paint and get it on their cars and track and all that. We only tagged along for about 16 miles, and two vehicles couldn't wait for crews to pull over, which they do frequently to help traffic flow. This car was passing while they were painting, leaving their mark until next year. I don't want to get that phone call that somebody got hurt, and I don't want to get the phone call that the public got hurt because they didn't know we were there. But I'd love to be able to give them the number of everybody that made it home at night because of what they do, because they are awesome at what they do. The main DOT uses more than 1.5 million of these glass beads and over 250,000 gallons of paint per year across the state going out of their way so you could be on your way. I'm Clay Gordon, New Center, Maine.